Welcome to Empress Speak, guys. This is the Empress. I'm so happy to have you guys here with me today. All right, so we're going to jump into the month of February, February 2019. I want to see what general messages do we have for my Scorpios. This is going to be for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Um, if this message does not resonate with you, you can check out your Moon, your um, Rising and Venus sign as well, okay? All right, so if you're new to my channel, I would like to um, ask you to subscribe, um, don't forget to like, comment, and share, guys. All right, so let's hop into it. What messages do we have for Scorpios? All right. What messages do we have for my Scorpios for the month of February? February 2019. What messages do you have for my Scorpios? February 2019. Ooh. All right, Scorpios, we got deception here. All right. All right, we have codependency here. They're flying out. All right, one more. What message do you have for my Scorpios? What message do you have for Scorpios? Someone rising, being Scorpios for the month of February. What message do you have for Scorpios? There we go. All right, we have pay attention to the red flags. Definitely, definitely something going on here, guys. Definitely. All right. What messages do you have for my Scorpios? Please give me clarifiers. This is heavy, 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 deep shit here, Scorpios. All right, so let's take a look and see what's going on. All right, this is deep. What messages do we have for my Scorpios? This is the sun, moon, rising, Venus, Scorpios. What messages do you have for my Scorpios? My subscribers, what messages do you have for my Scorpios? All right, even if these are messages, um, messages can go either way. They can be vice versa. All right, so this could be you doing this to someone or this could be someone you're involved with doing this to you, okay? All right, let's take a look. Bottom of the deck, guys, we have the high priestess. Definitely secrets here, okay? There's secrets, yeah. We have the high priestess and the empress here, okay? So there could be like some mystery woman. Um, there you could be dealing with the Pisces, um, but I'm definitely, definitely, since there's something could be definitely hidden here. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, damn Scorpios. All right. Let's go. Let's do it. All right. Past energy, guys. Here with deception. Definitely someone regrets stabbing someone here in the back. Someone could even be asking for another opportunity or another chance or even like some type of resource or finance asking for money or something. But someone definitely here is regretting something ending. OK, something ended. Someone is definitely having regrets here with this Bible cups and this ten of swords. This page of cups is telling me that there is communication um, or some of you guys are regretting um, cutting off communication or there is someone regretting this type of energy. Um, I do feel like there was, could have been some type of betrayal here with this deception card here. Could be a uh, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn involved, Pisces, um, Cancer, Scorpio. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Okay, for present energy here with codependency, guys, it looks like this is in regards to something from the past. Someone is codependent. Okay, um, I feel like you are waiting. You're waiting for a new something new. You're waiting for a new fresh relationship here with this Ace of Cups and this Two of Cups. Okay, um, someone is too codependent. You're feeling as if the, that someone is too needy or someone is possibly having some type of addictions here or this is vice versa. So you are possibly putting things on your on hold. There's something here from your past that you're like, you know, I'm going to put this on hold for now. I'm looking for something new here with this Ace of Cups and this Two of Cups. You're wanting something fresh, new. Okay. Going into the near future, guys, we'll pay attention to the red flags. All right. The signs are cautioning you. Definitely. Okay. I feel like someone could um, be offering you um, some type of some type of something here, some type of happiness. OK, someone could be asking you for a relationship going to the near future. But you definitely have to be careful here because we got this seven of cups issue, seven of cups as well as the moon. OK, so someone has options here and there's something that they're hiding. They're not being honest here. So there's something that you need to pay attention to here. Scorpios. OK, someone is definitely wearing a false mask here and going into going even going into the near future. You still have to be careful. Maybe they're offering some type of have some type of thing, something that they want to offer to you. Um, but someone here is 
has a lot, lots and lots and lots of options, and they could possibly even be hiding something here with this moon card. Could be dealing with the Pisces. Be careful because I'm telling you, like this, what they have to offer is possibly going to stress you out here with this nine of swords. Okay. Something that they have to offer, what they're offering you, um, they're offering you, oh, I can do this for you. I can do that. I'm this type of person. I'm that type of person. Right. But you have to be careful with this person is, is kind of sneaky, has sneaky energy about it. Um, and what they have to offer could possibly cause you to stress and worry. Okay. We're not dealing with that 2K19. Not at all. All right, so let's see what additional messages we have for Scorpios. What additional messages do we have here for my Scorpios for February 2019? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. These are general reads. They would not resonate with every single Scorpio. However, if they do, make sure you like this video. Leave me a comment. Let me know what's going on um, in the comment section below. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to click the bell to subscribe. All right, guys. Scorpio, Sun, Moon, and Rising. What additional messages do you have for Scorpios? Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. Bottom of the deck. Here we go again. We got that Five of Cups. Someone is definitely regretting something here. Um... Some of you guys could be dealing with the Virgo. I got fire energy, definitely Leo. But someone is definitely having regrets, okay? Some of you guys are possibly wanting to... You're thinking about something long-term, definitely, okay? You're thinking about something long-term here. We got the Four of Wands, the Two of Cups, and the Three of Cups. Definitely celebration coming together. This is even the marriage card. This is something long-term and guaranteeing stability. This is what you're thinking about. You're thinking about things long-term stability here, okay? Um, I feel as if past energy, guys, you, your guard was up, okay? You were guarding your emotions, okay? You were definitely guarding your, emo your emotions. You were guarding your feelings because you felt as if this person could have been deceptive. Okay, possibly something you found out about this person. All right. I feel like some of you guys are are being patient. You want to say something. You want to go ahead and put something out. You want to go ahead and express yourself and take some type of risk or leap of faith. There could even be an Aries involved. Going into the near future, guys, we got the Justice card. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Libra. All right. Ace of Wands, Fire Energy, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. But this also talks about a new start, a new beginning. But there's something here about possibly having some type of balance. Something is... Um, I feel like you're not you're going to be deciding not to give this a, a, for a new start. Something here. Yeah, there's an ending here. You're not giving someone another chance. You're not giving them a, a second shot at something or you even if it's not a second shot. A, even if a new person comes around, I feel like there be careful because there could be some things that are hidden. OK, there could be some things that are kept in the dark that you possibly are going to be finding out in the near future. I feel like some of you guys are not going to want a, another start with this. Possibly it could be a Libra. OK, definitely could be a Libra. But I'm feeling like some of you guys are definitely having regrets. Some of you guys have learned your lesson. OK, so you guys are putting your guard up. You are you aren't as easy to. Um, to pull the wool. They can't easily pull the wool over your eyes. You guys' eyes are wide open. Good job, Scorpio. I feel like that's the best energy to have because something in the past possibly taught you some type of lesson. So you're taking that energy and you're you're taking that with you. You're, you're, you're not going to be gullible and let someone just come in and sell you some type of dream. You're not having it. All right, Scorpios, I want to thank you guys so much. I love that energy. Keep that energy, guys, because I feel like that is going to bring you success in the near future, okay? Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I will be back, guys, within the next week. Um, we're going to do all types of spread, guys. Oh, I got all types of new spreads coming in. Thank you guys so much for tuning in with me. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and ciao for now. See you guys later.